White Light, White Heat is a song released by the American rock band The Velvet Underground in January 1968, from their second studio album White Light, White Heat. <laughs> Background White Light, White Heat was recorded in the course of the recording sessions for White Light, White Heat in September 1967 at Scepter Studios in Manhattan. The song's vocals are performed primarily by Lou Reed, with John Cale and Sterling Morrison performing backing vocals. The song, much like, "'I'm Waiting for the Man'", features a pounding rock and roll barrelhouse-style piano vamp. The song is about the sensations produced by intravenous injection of methamphetamine and features a heavily distorted electric bass outro played by John Cale over a single chord. This bass solo purportedly mimics the throbbing, ear-ringing effects experienced during the methamphetamine rush. White Light, White Heat was released in January 1968 as a single with the B-side, Here She Comes Now. White Light, White Heat", was also a staple of the Velvet Underground's live performances from 1967 on. The tune appears on numerous live bootleg albums, and the nearly nine-minute version included on the group's posthumous 1969 live double LP is one of the album's centerpieces. Reed also recorded a live version of the song in 1974, which featured on his Rock and Roll Animal and Greatest Hits albums. Lou Reed went on to perform the song with several notable names, including David Bowie, Metallica and the Raconteurs. <laughs> <laughs> David Bowie version The song was regularly performed live by David Bowie. A version he recorded in 1973 was released as a single in 1983 to promote the album Ziggy Stardust, The Motion Picture. Bowie, a longtime Velvets fan, had been performing, "'White Light, White Heat' since 1971. His album of that year, Hunky Dory, features a credit to the song for having inspired Bowie's, "'Queen Bitch'. It had featured throughout the Ziggy Stardust tour including a performance with Lou Reed on July 8, 1972, been recorded by Bowie for two BBC sessions, and been slated for inclusion on pin-ups the backing track from this session was later recorded as a solo version by Mick Ronson in 1975. Despite this, the Ziggy Stardust, the motion picture project would be the first time the song had been issued on a Bowie record, and as such it was released as a single. With Bowie at the peak of his global stardom thanks to Let's Dance, White Light, White Heat was considered an unusual turn for the pop audience he had attracted, and reached only number 46 in the UK. Bowie performed the song during his 1987 Glass Spider tour, a live version of which was released in 1988 re -released in 2007 on Glass Spider. The song continued to feature in Bowie's live repertoire throughout his career. In popular culture Two traditional music-influenced versions of the song were included on the soundtrack to the 2012 film Lawless, one by the bootleggers featuring Mark Lanigan and one by bluegrass legend Ralph Stanley. The live version of the song from Reed's Rock and Roll Animal was specially covered by Julian Casablancas for the HBO television series Vinyl. It appeared on the soundtrack of the fifth episode, during a flashback to a fictional Reed gig in 1973. Personnel Lou Reed, lead vocals, rhythm guitar John Cale, fuzz bass, piano, backing vocals Sterling Morrison, lead guitar, backing vocals Maureen Tucker, percussion. <laughs> <laughs>